everyone and welcome to the Asia Pacific Lightning Week 2023 here in Johor Bahru, Malaysia. Johor Bahru is the ancestral land of indigenous peoples or Orang Asli, including the Orang Lapu, the natives of the Straits of Johor. The Asia Pacific Climate Week in Johor Bahru aims to do a regional stock taking about climate achievements leading to the road to Club 28. For our work in IPMSDL, we wish to learn, listen, and link to continue amplifying indigenous people's rights and ownership of ancestral lands in climate justice talks. The APCW 2023 opened up with a performance waking up the audience to the nightmares of climate in action and coming together for the planet. High-level Malaysian government and UN officials welcomed the reported 2,000 participants, including us from IPMSDL and other IP delegates. Some notable emphases mentioned in the welcome is about having a clear vision unique climate ambition, the need for climate action to achieve development, and the role of indigenous peoples and local communities. The Asia-Pacific Climate Week setup somehow mirrors what's on COP, Climate Action Hub that looks like the pavilions, exhibits, lots of exhibits, but mostly from government and private businesses. So I think next time they can do better in sponsoring grassroots, community, constituency, and CSO spaces. There are also spaces for individual commitments and pledges to combat climate change. And of course, we're featuring our message for indigenous rights. There are also a lot of calls for peace, social justice, and youth power. Plus a display about the endangered sea cow that are commonly found in Asian waters. We're also happy to meet with indigenous youth, women, and climate youth activists who share their voices. So you better check out their videos on IPMSDL's page to listen to their messages. One big session that day was the Global Stock Take Regional Dialogue. An interesting stress is about how much this just transition really cost? And will it again come from debts, loans, and private financing? There was also a call for enhancing support for the young people. And indigenous peoples are very active in laying down on the floor the many unaccounted contributions and the challenges that they face. My last session was on socially inclusive sustainable climate action and the role of local research, which made me realize the huge contribution community researchers can give if they own and build climate researches and solutions. So that's a wrap for now. So more to come from Asia Pacific Climate Week 2023.